Hi everybody, um, I just wanted to do a quick video um, because I wanted to share something uh, like issues I've been having uh, recently and and then I think I'm figuring it out and I'm just I want to share with you in case you're having the same issues uh, maybe it can be helpful and if it you don't have the same issues then ignore this video all right so um, I've been doing Tracy Anderson for years and years and years. I did the DVDs, meta, continuity, streaming, 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 and I do it religiously every day. It's always done great things to my body and I love it. I love the method and, you know, overall there's always been a positive evolution. Um, until a few months ago, uh, I started experiencing and observing the few, three things, okay? Three main things. One, I was getting lower back pain. So like my lower back here is like really, really, really tired um, to a point where I didn't even work out end of December and beginning of January and that like never, ever happens. Uh, so lower back pain. Um, the other thing I was experiencing is, look, the bulges, what I call the bulge with the, the girlfriends. It's the bulge. Um, this bulge was, I've always had a strong gluteus medius, so these muscles have always been kind of strong thanks to the method, um, but they were never protruding like this. So one, I don't really like the look of protruding kind of like muscles like that. And then, but more specifically, I just feel like, well, if it's overdeveloped, which it obviously is, that to me screams out imbalance and it feels like, well, if that's overdeveloped, something else is underdeveloped. So I don't like that. Um, and so there was that. And the other thing was that a lot of people with this new kind of chapter of streaming that took place, I don't know, uh, six months or nine months ago, um, a lot of people started getting really nice, high lifted butts. And I wasn't seeing any of that on me. Like I saw like a minute lift and that's it. Um, so I was like, okay, what's going on? Some people have you know, are, are doing perfectly fine and have a high lifted butt and I have a thigh bulge, lower back pain and my butt's like flat and low, you know, like it, like it, it is like it always has been. Um, and so I couldn't understand what was going on until in recent weeks, we've been talking about the, these things a lot. And I started thinking and overanalyzing and talking to people and observing and looking and whatever. And one of the things, um, that, that I think is going to help is that, and what's happened is that this muscle, this gluteus medius, by the way, is a muscle that is uh, there for abduction. Okay. So when you're doing, anytime you're lifting your leg away, right? So like this, like that, you know, like this, right? Things like, like, like this, right? Look familiar, right? So we've always been doing those moves. And so that's why it's always been strong. But, uh, oh, it, the other thing it also gets involved in is rotation, right? So hip rotation. So you see, like this, that it gets involved in that. But it's not the only player, you know, like there are other loads of players involved in, in this, okay? Now, what I think has happened is that in recent months, um, she's been doing a lot of like boot, booty lifting exercises, which is great for like the posterior part of the glute. And I think my muscle here is, has been overdeveloped uh, because it was probably very strong in the first place. And sometimes, you know, it, 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 it kind of started becoming too developed and started overtaking the, the booty muscle. Okay, like the glute max and like all the, you know, the, this part of the, of the glute. And in where, in, in like, in moves that it shouldn't even be really that involved in. Um, so for example, and this is a really basic one, but I know that this is my issue because I'm somebody who externally rotates a lot. Like, you know, some people just externally rotate like this. Like I'm not one of these people. I just go like all the way and up and everything. And, and you can see that when I, when I do this, okay. See the bulge, right? Like you see this, this okay it is so on right and i'm actually not really feeling it in the glute um and and the stronger this one gets the stronger it gets right and the less this does which is why my booty's not lifting and which is why this one is always protruding and because she's been doing so all these booty lifting moves now things where it shouldn't even like 
you know, uh, be involved in at all, it's like, I always feel like it's on. Like, I feel like it's always, it always wants to like not mind it on its own business, right? So even in things that don't involve it so much, it's getting activated. So what I need to be careful of, so for example, I'm using the simple exercise is when she does a th something like, like this, where she kicks up, I have to not externally rotate too much. So if you look in my butt, you'll see, right? Like, so if I don't externally rotate, if I go like this, I, I, I turn this on, right? And then, and then I lift and I keep it turned on, okay? And, and it's externally rotated, but not too much. So I'm feeling it here. If I do what I normally do, it's gonna be like this. And then the bulge comes and this gets activated and the other one doesn't. So I need to be really careful with the way I do uh, my moves and I need to make sure that this one doesn't get overly activated. And in fact, I think some of the moves I should be doing are very basic moves that might not have anything to do with the method, but it might be stuff like, <laughs> like this, you know, to get this guy working a little bit harder and getting this guy to work a little bit less. Um, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, and I have to really pay attention, uh, because, because this is what is causing my back pain, right? You're getting back to the back pain. Um, when this is tight, when your piriformis is tight, your glute medius, all this area of like the hip are, is tight, it's a strain on your back. And when your booty is, is weak, um, well, that's also bad for your back. So the two combined is, is causing back pain, is causing a really tired back, which is what I was experiencing. So I'm going to experiment this. I'm going to do back to AMC, I guess. Um, but whatever I do, uh, I'm going to just have to really pay attention to not overactivate these. Okay, and I know some of you have the bulge. If you've got the bulge, it's because you're overusing this muscle. So pay attention to how you feel when you're doing the moves. And if you feel like this is working, then stop and do it really slowly or modify the move slightly uh, so that it fires here as opposed to here. And in a way, maybe that's what Tracy meant when she said uh, earlier this week, she was like, well, if somebody's, you know, bulking from AMC, it's because they're not doing it right. Um, well, maybe they're not doing it right because they don't know where they're supposed to feel it. Um, and if you're not feeling it in the right place, yeah, and, 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 and building the right muscles, then yeah, you will bulk. Um, and, and you need to learn how to build the right muscles, right? So, and, and, and to sh quiet down the, um, the, the ones that are overactive. So it's a lot of kind of uh, work, but like, I think it will be helpful. We'll see, stay tuned. I hope this was helpful for some of you.